I wanted to do something that helped people change their lives in a really big way. I decided to do some research and I discovered zero waste, that term, and it honestly really uh, frightened me at first because as someone who never thought about throwing away garbage as a whole, I didn't even know how to get to that point of zero waste. And uh, three months into learning about that, I decided to actually quit because it wasn't attainable. And then I found another resource that was really more about being imperfectly sustainable and understanding every little step that you take is something that gets you further on your path, further on your journey. I discovered that in Australia and New Zealand and all over the world there were a lot of different refill stores and that's when I decided to figure out how to start one in Cincinnati. To anyone who may think that this doesn't matter and the small changes don't add up over time, I can see the changes that these purchases can make. At the bottom line, businesses like Target or Amazon or anything like that, they're about the money. And when they see that consumers like us want things that are more sustainable, then they create and they offer things that are more sustainable. That is one big way that all of these small changes make a really big impact. We're all going through this together. We're all trying to unlearn a bunch of learned behaviors about how to consume and how to dispose of the things that we consume. And it is a process to learn and grow and change, and that process is something that takes time.